the Unimotor crossbars that fit the 2020 Subaru Forester. They fit some other models too, so if you look at the link in the description, it'll show you all the models that it fits. Um, Unimotor did send me these to review and demonstrate for you guys. There's also going to be a promo link down below in the description. That'll give you a discount off the product. They do come with two crossbars, instructions, and an Allen wrench to go ahead and install them. The instructions are inside and we're gonna show you guys how to do that now. What to do is use the supplied Allen wrench to loosen this. And then this is gonna swing out below so that you can get it on. And there are some adjustments here. So if you need to make it wider or narrower, you just loosen these two and you can expand or retract it. Let me go and get them up on the roof and I'll show you guys what it looks like. Remember those adjustments I showed you before on each side? For the 2019 and up Super Forcer, you are gonna to wanna to loosen those to spread it out. Once you've got it spread out, you're gonna to want to snugly fit it on each side and then you're gonna swing around the clamp just like that that goes on the bottom. You're gonna see the uh, Allen bolt come up right here and you're just gonna tighten that until you get it all the way down. You're gonna to wanna to make sure that it's straight. So that's really important, make sure that it's not crooked at all and it's running parallel to your roof. All right, we're gonna we're gonna tighten that most of the way. We're gonna tighten the other side and then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna come back and I'm gonna tighten these bolts. The build quality on these is really good. Um, they're much better than the JAG crossbars that I installed last year. And these look very, very, very similar to the OEM aero bars. So um, this is nice powder coated metal. It had some dirt on it from me flipping it. This is, I believe, injection molded plastic. So it's nice and hard and uh, the overall quality feels really good. What you want to keep in mind is they are labeled rear, I'm sorry, rear and front, and they are different. They're different lengths. So if you find that it's not fitting, it means you probably have the wrong one on the wrong side. So just make sure that if it's too short or too long and you've adjusted those bolts, you might have the wrong one on the wrong side. So just keep that in mind. And they look great. They feel great. They look like they were made for the vehicle because you know what? They were made for this vehicle and they're sturdy. They're strong. We don't have any kayak trips planned, but we do have a surprise in store for what we're going to use these for in the meantime. So watch until the end just to see another little project, but here's another look at them. So I have the windows down because I want to demonstrate something. These crossbars don't make any sound. We're going about 55 right now, and we were going about uh, 75 up here and they're silent there's no whistling there's no humming I just wanted to share that the humming that you do hear maybe in the background is actually just from my uh, tires because they're pretty loud but I can't hear any additional wind noise whatsoever from the crossbar so great job they did a great job with the design <laughs> Oh,